A fashion show in South Korea has shown the world that clothes of the future may do more than just cover our bodies. They may even help us do our jobs. Here's more. Go, 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 go. At the 2006 ubiquitous computer fashion show, gadgets are embedded and attached to clothing. They apparently enhance and facilitate operations for military officers, firefighters and working moms. Futuristic military vests allow one to receive geographical data of the enemy's position via satellite, which is viewed via headset. Another model wears a point and gesture, allowing one to send coded messages. A firefighter wears a robotic computer device on his back called the actuator, which allows him to lift heavy objects. It may be used to save a victim who is trapped under heavy steel or concrete slabs in a collapsed building. To cater to fitness enthusiasts, vests measure one's heart rate and calories burned during exercise. Technology may also change sign language. Special gloves allow a person to tap their fingers, which records data to a device. The information is processed into an audio message, which plays through a speaker phone. A mother is wearing a device that is worn around the neck, which lights up when her baby's diapers need to be changed. In the next generation, information technology and people will unite. We wanted to display IT that reflected humanism, which we wanted to show in our wearable computer fashion show. The fashion show gave Susie Jo pride of the technological advancement her home country displayed at the fashion show. It was really touching to see that such a fashion show has opened in our country, and I think it was a chance to see again what a strong IT country we are. Now, you are in the middle of the IT.